So the Doug Warren Hurdle is next now after my commentating friend Doug and it's the top one is Hennessy Hearted for Joseph Peppolo, Linford Skittler, Graham Crutterbrook, Occasionally Castle, Hems, Pacific Storm, Greg Beckwith, Return of the Royal, Joshua Sutherland, Shafgarn Thirsty for David Robertson, Smokey Joe, Paul O'Neill, Taken James Shea, Tamanarco Gift, Darren Thompson, Cashmere Coat, Paul Rhodes, Dishy, T Rogers and Swordbearer Leon Van Rinsberg. Three miles a trip this time and away they go. Way towards the first flight, a short run to the first, and then all over that one. Nicely, occasionally, Castle just about the back marker. The really white grey, the only grey in this race. But Linford Skittler has gone on to take an early lead from Hennessy Hearted in second. A little gap to Pacific Storm Dishes after that one. Smoky Joe, as they sort themselves out, a sensible sort of pace. Three mile hurdle. And Linford Skittler leads by a batter neck to Hennessy Hearted in second. Gap of three then to Smokey Joe. Taken. Pacific Storm in the white sleeve has just been driven up on the inside there to probably just about shade third. With Tamanarco Gift just the back marker of this. Early stage of the race, the Linford Skittler has skittled off into a three length lead. We get that up to four now as he just puts a bit of pace to the race there. And Hennessy Hearted, Chucky holding that one back in second as they skip over the second flight. And occasionally castles a little untidy at the back, but nothing too serious. And Linford Skittler has now gone five clear of Hennessy Hearted in second and Pacific Storm in third. Smokey Joe in the green sleeves and a red cap with fourth as they take number three. And occasionally Castle dropped that one much better. It's still the back marker. Linford Skittler has probably six lengths clear now as they take that one. And Pacific Storm has moved through into second. Hennessy Hearted is third and Smokey Joe fourth and Dishy in fifth. Return of the Royal get a little bit closer in those black and red hoops as they take number five. The grey occasionally castle just finding the pace a little bit hot at this stage of the race. And Linford Skittler is going to take them past the winning post with a complete circuit to go. Pacific Storm is second. Smokey Joe 3 and return of the Royal 4. Dishy 5 and Hennessy Hearted has dropped back into 6. Then Cashmere Coat and Tamanarco Gift. Sword Bear after that one. Then Shafgarn Thirsty and Taken. And had a shot and towards the back. Towards the towards Had a shot and totally out the back is occasionally Castle. I'm surprised to see that one pull up before too long. It's quite a long way away now. And Linford Skittler is 5 clear. Pacific Storm in second. Return of the Royal third. Hennessy Hart is moved back up into fourth. And Smokey Joe, Cashmere Coat. As close as that one's been so far. Just got a little bit of a freeze up there on the screen. That way. Back with it again. And there's occasionally Castle. And Linford Skittler. Going down to a little more than four now as Return of the Royal has moved into second. And Pacific Storm is third and Smokey Joe is fourth. Hennessy Hearted and Cashmere Coat. Dishes after that one in Tamanarco Gift and Sword Bearer. With Shafgan Thirsty closest to us as they take number seven. Taken is the back one of the main group. Occasionally Castle the Grey is some way away and hasn't been pulled up as yet though. Uh, you better for him if he's not pulled up because he'll get a better handicap. Might one is they jump number eight. Uh, over that one they go. With Linford Skittler. Only three lengths clear now. Maybe even only two. A return of the Royal second, Pacific Storm third, then a little bit of a gap back to the rest of them are beginning to bunch. Hennessy Hearted is running a strange race. It's now dropped back to be the back marker of the main protagonists. So don't really count occasional castle at the moment. But Linford Skittler's lead is down to a length. 
Return of the Royal is second. Pacific Storm is third. Then a gap back to Dishy. Then Sword Bearer is getting ominously closer. Then Shafgan Thirst is also getting closer as well. Tamarako Gift is next. Then Cashmere Coat. Smoky Joe's lost his place. A little bit taken. Has always been near the back of the front. And Hennessy Hearted. Look like that one's done for the day as well. And we look around the corner there. We can't see it. Cashmere Cat will see how far behind he is. He must be an absolute mile behind. Anyway, Linford Skittler being pressed now by Dishy, and Dishy's come through to take it up then. So Dishy jumps over the ninth in the lead and quickly goes two lengths clear as Linford Skittler goes out like a light, goes out like a skittle, doesn't he? And skittled over. But it's Dishy in the lead, and suddenly the whole complexion of the race changes, and it's now looking more like a five furlong sprint field than a three mile hurdle as they take the third from home Shaft Gan Thirst has gone into the lead Taken's come from the back to throw out a big challenge then comes Cashmere Coat, then Tamanarko gives Sword Bearer his lumen as they take the second last and it's Shaft Gan Thirsty in the lead being challenged by Taken, also Cashmere Coat return of the Royal Tamanarko gift and Sword Bearer they're all backing on their animals his final flight and it's Shaft Gan Thirsty Shaft Gan Thirsty lands in the lead from Taken in second, it's Shaft Gan Thirsty in front then Taken return of the Royal Linford Skittles gone so soon as he hearted but it's Shaft Shafkan Thirsty, Shafkan Thirsty racing into the final half furlong and Shafkan Thirsty looks like he's going to take it, Shafkan Thirsty he's the winner from return of the wall, he's going to be second then Cashmere Coat was third, Sun Bearer fourth and then Tamarako Gift and Taken, Pacific Storm, Dishy and finally Smoky Joe so occasionally Castle did eventually get pulled up and so did two others in the straight there, the long time leader Linford Skittler but Shafkan Thirsty takes it for David Robertson in what some may see as a messy sort of race because Linford Skittler really turned on the uh, speed there so Shafgun first he takes it for David Robertson return of the Royal Joshua Sutherland second sword bearer Leon Van Rensburg was third Cashmere Coat for Paul Rhodes fourth and Tamanarko Gift or Darren Thompson was fifth and you can see there that occasionally Castle did pull up but was injured so let's hope that one's back next week